Hi everyone. Hi everyone. So today I'm bringing you a quick review of my my first top 10 um, fragrance that I love, 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 love. And if you know anything about me, I love fragrance. Oh, you should know I love fragrance. So I'm just going to jump right in. Now I have 10 as I said, but I have 8 Eau de Perfume and I have 2 Eau de Toilette. And I've come to realize that the perfumes are more um, high pot potent and like there's more concentrated. While the Eau de Toilette is less... Um, Less concentrated, and it also the eau de toilette will cost less than the eau de perfume. So, first of all, I have an eau de perfume in a 1.7 ounce, and this is the Gucci. I'm sorry, sorry, Couture Lala by, by Juicy Couture. And I received and I bought this at Marshall's for um, it's a 1.7 bottle, and I, I purchased it at Marshall's now. I will say it has a nice florally scent this would be great for the summer you go into a you know a, a little summer event a family outing in the summer this is a to-go um, fragrance I will say I'm not a big fan of all of the Gucci I'm um, sorry I love some Gucci I've got Gucci to review as well I'm not a big fan of um, Juicy Couture but this one I will say I do like and um, this is my first bottle trying that, and I must say I like it. I must jump into this one right away. And this is the Victoria's Secret. If you can see that, very sexy now. And this is my second bottle, so I love this. This is a great, and I can't emphasize how great this fragrance is. This is a Eau de Perfume, and it's in a, <clears throat> a 1.7 bottle. Like I said, I get this at um, my local Victoria's Secret. And I have wore this to like a, a, a barbecue, an outing. It's, this is my second bottle. It is wonderful. It is a great, great, great summer fragrance. Um, it's nice and florally. It was more, no, actually it's more, it's more like a, a fruity scent. I could have an undertone of some like a little peachy. Um, undertone it's lovely the bottle is beautiful it has a nice little turquoise bottle a nice little bow that says I'm um, very sexy now a little charm a great go-to fragrance in my opinion now this is something I've tried for the first time and I've tried about about two months ago and I like it and it's the Gwen Stefani lamb and this is in a 1.7 bottle as a eau de toilet perfume. Now, this is more, I must say, first of all, this is cute, it has a little L, and I like it because it has like a little cute co a little colors, like it's red and like a gold and a green, nice little culture bottle. Um, I came across this, I don't use it as much as you can see, but I came across this on Groupon, looking for some other stuff and this was there, and I said, oh, let me try it, and it's pretty good. Um, it's a nice summer fragrance, it's a, it can be have a little undertone being strong it has like a semi masculine if I want to say but it's still feminine it, it, it's a weird scent but it, it, it smells good it's not like a overly masculine or overly feminine it's just more like maybe I would think this maybe could be like a, a unisex um, fragrance but this is also a good um, fragrance to go to and like I said, like I said Groupons and I'll leave all the prices um, what I pay for them below Next, I will jump right into the next one, and this is the Very Hollywood, Very Hollywood, and by Michael Kors. And let's see, and this is the 1.7 bottle. Now, I have heard that this is discontinued. I found this on Groupons, and I was only interested because a friend of mine, one of my besties, <laughs> said to me when she smelled, which in the next one was my Michael, my um, Kenny Cole Black. That it was so similar to the very sexy Hollywood. I'm sorry, very Hollywood by Michael Kors. And then I was like, oh, I never smelled that. So I saw it on Google. I said, like, okay, I'll try it. It was like for 30 something dollars on sale. And I must say, they are very similar. I love this perfume. You could wear this in the night, you could wear this in the day. Um, it is so similar to my black, I'm gonna say. It has a nice, 
florally but still mild undertone when you first spray it it will probably come off a little strong but for the most part it smells really well and um I there's nothing I can bad say about this perfume like I like it it's a other perfume it's um it lasts I love it I, I mean if I could find another bottle somewhere else I will be looking for this now this is also one of my favorites and this is also this is the black by Kenny Cole and this is the 3.4 bottle in that eau de perfume and this also has like a it could be a little unisex but when it dries it dries like a more in a florally scent um I must say I love this perfume I've been wearing this perfume for years and um, I actually came across it in my local Perfuma, which is a, a little boutique for perfumes, a perfume store. And I had to buy it. Um, there's nothing bad I could say about it. The only thing sometimes, like I will say, it does, when you first spray it, it has, if you're really allergic like, to like stronger scent, but it will die down. And it lasts all day. Even when I don't even smell it, other people are like, what do you have on? I'm like, can it cold black? Because I don't even smell it. It's so, so good. I cannot emphasize how good this black is so um this is a to go maybe no more now i wouldn't wear this in the day because of oh it can be strong at first but definitely a night going out on a town ladies night or a date night this is the fragrance you would like to go your to go fragrance next the next one i have is which everybody probably have it as well but i love it it's chloe white chloe and this is a 1.7 bottle and it's the Ode perfume now this also has a great florally tone to it. Um, I've heard people say they use this in the day. It's not really a night perfume, but I've also used it at night, and I think it smells beautiful in the night. It has a in the night air, summer air. I would say summer night. I don't. I haven't tried it in the winter night, but summer night. This is a great perfume. Like I say, it's a 1.7 bottle. I got this at Groupon as well, and I will link all. Like I said, I'll link all the prices below. And this is the 1.7 bottle in an Eau de Perfume, and I love it. I mean, it's nice, it's florally, without being too florally, it, it dries nice, it's, it lasts. There's, I can't say anything bad about this perfume. It's really, really, really lovely. Um, I love the cute little bottle, little bow in front. <clears throat> um, this is a good to go perfume. Like I said, I would try this more in the day, but I have also tried it at night, and it, 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 it stands up to time. It's really great. Now, I have this other perfume over here, and this is Rem, and it's by Erox, which I didn't even know that, I just found that out recently, and this is a 3.4 bottle, and this is the Eau de Perfume, 3.4 ounces bottle, I should say, and this smells delicious. It dries delicious. This perfume, as you can see, is like almost finished. It's a great, great fragrance. And I will say, at first, it does have a little masculine, um, like a masculine smell to it, but it does die down and it does dry very, very well. Um, it, it, I, I really can't compare it to anywhere where it would similar, where it would smell, smell to, but I love it. it it's like I've got this at um, Perfuma and I was kind of leery about it, but I love it. It smells delish it's has a, like I said a little strong when you when it dies down it has like a nice little citrusy floral scent um I have, there's nothing bad I can say about this perfume it's really nice just if you if you just want floral off the top I would just say spray it like maybe an hour or maybe 40 minutes before you leave the house let it kind of die down and go out and it's the way to go it's delish now this one I just came across actually I don't know it's it's just almost finished and this is the nine west and I believe it cleaves called love fairy and this is by nine west and this is the Ode Perf perfume in a 1.7 bottle and unfortunately it's almost finished but this is a great fragrance I would wear this definitely hands down in the day this is a nice florally it dries florally, floral in a nice floral scent. It sprays on beautifully. It's a great perfume. And I got this at the Nine West um, store. And it was like sitting on the counter. And I think believe it was like $10. And I'm like, really? And then I tried it and I was like, $10 perfume? Mm, okay. I can't go wrong. I wish I had bought more. It's, it's good. It's like a cute little bottle. You could probably give it around Christmas time or any holiday time. 
or like graduations this is a great little bottle it's very um florally and it has like a good undertone it's really 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 nice so my last two now is both by Gucci and and they're the Eau de Toilette perfumes and this is my Gucci Guilty now actually I, another friend of mine oh sorry you can see that lighting is a little bright yes and this is a 3.4 bottle sorry I'm sorry 2.5 bottle and I got this at Macy's and a friend of mine um suggested this to me and I was just like okay and I tried it this is a stronger perfume it's real strong it does die down but this is I'll tell you right off the bat it's strong hands down this is a strong fragrance you gotta like it if you don't like strong fragrance this is not the one for you because this is quite 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 strong but it does die down a little bit and it's very it lasts to me very long I didn't even realize actually like did I was gonna do this video that it was my Eau de um, Toilet I would think this was an Eau de Perfume it, it lasts really well I, I to go and at night I would wear this at night and my last but not least one, which I know is, um, is discontinued, but I found it sometimes like at my local malls or little shop, little boutiques here and there. And this is the Gucci Rush 2. It's by Gucci. And this is my 2.5. And like I said, this is my Eau de Toilette. And it's on the other side. You can see it's like Gucci Rush. I love this perfume. I've worn this perfume for years. I mean... I think I've been wearing this perfume for over 15, 16 years. I love this perfume. This perfume is like to go. I mean, I wish, I don't know what's going on with Gucci, but please bring it back. Um, I know they have like Gucci one or another Gucci, but this Gucci rush in the pink bottle is what I owe. Gucci two is where I've always go. This is the summer to go perfume. You're going anywhere in the summer, water parks. Um, barbecues, family reunions, any daytime out activity, this is a perfume you want to spray on and go. And you really, really have to refresh yourself with it. It's, it when you spray it, it's on, it's on. And I have to say, this is the way to go. And it's a great to go perfume. And that's all for today. And if there's any questions, um, please link them below. Please subscribe, and I want to hear all the feedbacks. If you have any perfumes you want me to try, please throw it at me. I'm a perfume little junkie, and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Take care, guys. See you soon. Bye-bye.